There's a cave behind the waterfall. No shit. Try going up that hill. We can get to the bridge that way. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. This thing was all terrain. You gotta gun it before you hit the hill. Made it. I'll be right back. All right, happy hunting. Let's roll. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I right, just keep it straight. Watch the sides. Oh! 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 Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I right, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ.
upward and upward. There we go. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, my spine. I'm gonna scout around. <sighs> Love this weather. Yeah, a bit humid. <laughs> Not Panama humid. Yeah, it's all relative, I guess. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> hey, Nathan, you maybe you want to ease up? Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. It's going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. But with Nate being so eager, he doubled the press. He would have doubled it anyway. I'll bet we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch. My fault. There's a path at the mouth of that stream up there. Hang on tight. Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... Why, exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities are closing in on him. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape or something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era.
Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. Hey, did you know our car came with a winch? Oh, really? I didn't know. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. to do it. Exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> Those poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor, patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut.